What is going on guys and welcome to episode 5, season 3 of my Aston Villa career mode. Today we are starting it off at home in the Premier League against Cardiff City. Hi there again, Martin Tyler here, Alan Smith alongside me and it's Barclays Premier League action for you. And here we've got for you today Aston Villa against Cardiff City. The Aston Villa team for this game. Adrian starts in goal. Tyson starts looking to recover his form. So a couple of strikers for them at the front end of the team. Here's the 11 fielded by Cardiff City today. David Marshall starts in goal. Bruno Equele Manga starts despite looking shaky in recent games. Craig Noon starts looking to recover his form. And they've got plenty of goal threat with two strikers in the attack. All right, Zuccolini here. Oh, getting past his man quite easily. Absolutely love him. He's coming into his own. Nice little play there. Benteke and Bolo. All right, Mbolo. Karate. Oh, he's not going to give him enough space. Mbolo's there. Oh, nice little play. And Marvi's there forward. He goes down. No penalty. Oh, well up Tyson. Tyson winning headers. Mbolo, can you get the 1-2 going? Amavi still forward, Amavi, <laughs> Amavi with the left foot. Right, Mbolo, oh he wants it back, Karate wants it back, Karate, oh he's just lost the touch. Oh it's a corner, fair enough, right, let's put this ball in towards Benteke, he gets there, oh what a goal, his first goal back at Villa Park. Benteke and he's moved on to that ball with the exquisite time into dispatcher an excellent header into the bottom left well here's the goal again oh come on he needs to get that ball they get so lucky oh they've hit the crossbar <laughs> just before half time they got a corner all right let's defend this no goals for half time they have not been in this game at all be really disappointing if we concede now get it away Blow the whistle ref, we'll take half time right now. And that is half time, 1 0 to us. Benteke's goal separates the two sides. Alright, so we changed the formation. There's about 15 minutes to go. We're just going to be a bit more secure. We're going to go ahead and bring on Zivokic, uh, Aarons, and Veritu. Oh, well, Mikhail, that's yours. All day, all day, Mikhail. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. Whoa, Denea, Denea. <gasps> Denea, what are you doing? Oh my god. Go on, Dharma, get on the end of that. That's yours. All day. Inside. You got Sivolkic there. Good touch. One touch and shot. Oh, what a finish. Sivolkic off the bench scores yet again. Well, the substitute has made his mark on the game. Volkic, what a player. I think that's his fourth goal in as many games, I think. Something like that. He's got a ridiculous record coming off the bench. And that is the end of the game. We take it 2 0. Benteke and Sivolkic getting the goals. Hi there again, Martin Tyler here. Alan Smith alongside me. And it's Barclays Premier League action for you. Coming up now, Crystal Palace against Aston Villa. Aston Villa feeling good about their own game, looking for another victory. Last time out, they won at home against Cardiff City. Yeah, the result never looked in doubt in that 2 0 win, and uh, I don't think it would be in doubt for them today. I think they'll win. Really anticipating something special from him here today. What I like about him is his acceleration as much as just that outright pace. He, he can really leave somebody flat-footed when he's got a mind to it. Here's the Crystal Palace team. Joel Ward starts with Pab Suare as the full-backs. Wilfried Zaha starts looking to recover his form. Connor Wickham is the main striker today. The Aston Villa team for this game.
Alright, so I've rested a few of our key players because in the next game we will be going up against Penny from Lycos in the Champions League group stage. Ah, oh, Saha and Balassi done have caused me all sorts of problems. Good ball in, we managed to clear it. Quete can't bring it under control. Can't quite get it under control again. Oh, what a save, get up. Ah, oh, brilliant goalkeeping. They're just looking for Saha and Balassi every single time. And they caused me problems. Go on, Quetta, get there. Oh, he's done, yeah. He's done two of you. No, no, no. Oh, what a finish. Oh, come on. I could just tell it's going to happen as soon as Joel Ward is going past you like that. I don't even know who finished that, but what a finish. Oh, my own players getting in each other's way. Another ball into the box. They've just been using Saha and Balassi all game long, putting balls into the box at will. He can come out now with him. Bolo sees Jordan Verity making the midfield run. Gives it to Kuete. Kuete picks out Adama. What a counter attack this would be. No goal at the end of it, but we take a corner. One minute of added time. The last chance of the first half. Whip this one in. Need a quality ball. It's not bad. The keeper comes out for it, as always. Right, go on, Adama. Get there. Get there. Go on. Let's go. We've got it. Come inside. Oh, brilliant. Brilliant. All that training is working on his dribbling. Lay that one off for Ghana. Ghana sees Odegaard. Odegaard sees Adama. Oh, it's a fresh air shot. Alright, see if we can put a better ball in than what we have done. Balls to Mika. It's clear that was probably going in as well. Goes out to Sivokic on that right foot. Brings it down. It's blocked. Surprise, surprise. Alright, we see that coming. If you can win that header, of course not. Balls to Odegaard. Adama. Mika Richard is forward. Get in the box, what are you doing on, on, on the outside? Puts it in there. Oh, Odegaard was there as well again. <laughs> Go on, Odegaard, bring it forward. Odegaard still going. Odegaard slips through Munier. What a perfectly timed ball. He's got Zivokic in there. Goes to Adama. Oh, no, that was Mika. Mika getting forward. Ghana, last chance maybe. Martina, Mika, Adama. What was that pass? Oh, that was such good build up. Dama whips it in towards the back post. Keeper comes through it again. He's came for everything in this game. Literally everything. And that is the end of the game. 1 0. I would say that we deserve a draw, you know, but we just didn't have that finishing touch that we needed. Alan Smith alongside me. Alan, this is a very intriguing group. We had a couple of games for each club now. And now we're on to match day three. Beginning to shape up. Yeah, I think so. The group does begin to take shape and uh, we'll begin to see who are going to be the favourites to top it. And here we've got for you today, Aston Villa will play Panathinaikos. Aston Villa, well, they'll be working hard, I'm sure. Their last game was an away defeat against Crystal Palace. Well, it was 1-0 and uh, they, played, they played pretty well, I think, for large parts of the game. And for that reason, I think they'll, they'll probably win today. Villa team for this game. This is the lineup for the away side. Just to check on the formation. 4-4-2, but an interesting variation on it. Yeah, a little diamond in midfield, and uh, I wouldn't be surprised at some point. If it's not working, he'll go to a more conventional 4-4-2. Right, the first Champions League game at Villa Park. The first two we play were away to PSG and away to Atletico Madrid. So the first home game in the Champions League for, of this season for us. Adama's got a lot of space. If you can exploit it here, let's go. Adama comes inside, looking for an option. Comes inside, still going Adama. Sees Mbolo getting fancy there. Mbolo with a bit of space takes a shot. Good effort. Benteke back across goal. Mbolo's there again. Falls to Kuate. God, I can't quite get it under control, but a nice start from us there. Oh, Kuate is winning everything in midfield. Benteke is isolated out there. Surely he's got the pace to get past his man. Benteke tries to feed Mbolo. Mbolo. Oh, that finish. If that's on his left, oh, he's on his right foot, sorry. That could have tested the goalkeeper. All right, nice hold up play from Benteke. Douglas back in the team here. Puts an early ball in towards Mbolo. What a ball. Oh, what a ball from Douglas. And 
what a good header, thumping effort to the keeper's right. What a ball from Douglas. He's been out this side recently because his defence isn't the best, you know, to be fair to him, but when he comes forward, he's pretty good. And Benteke on the turn here, wants it on that left foot, test the goalkeeper. I mean, Benteke and Mbalo up front, what a handful. Oh, what a ball from Mbalo, slicing two defenders there to pick out Benteke. He holds it up well, sees Tyson. Tyson comes inside, comes inside again. Looking for a ball for Zuccolini. Can he get his first goal? Oh, that should have been 2 0. Right, Douglas. Is there a goal in this before half time? I think there is. One touch. Whips it in. What a ball. Benteke. Oh, you've got to be finishing those. What a ball that was as well towards the back post. And that is half time. 1 0, but it could easily be 3 or 2 0 here. Under working it well. They've had the ball for quite a long time. Just knocking it around at the back. They're starting to push forward, playing a high line. So I might change the formation after this attack to a 4-3-3, get some med in midfield, try and get some more control in the game. And that's what we're going to do right now. We're going to change the formation to the 4-3-3. We're still going to play the attacking version. Oh, brilliant, Denea. Brilliant. I love that. Kuwata can come forward now. You're not going to be able to hold him. He's too strong for you. Brilliant hold-up play from Mbolo. We've got Zuccolini there. Zuccolini, hold on to it. Oh, go on, Zuccolini. Go on, Zuccolini. Look at him. He's all on your shirt. Put fire that across. Oh, I should have just passed it. Odegaard was wide open. No. We'll clear it. Get it away. Munia. Odegaard on the break now. Can we wrap up the game? Sivokic is open if you can get the ball to him. Sivokic doing what he does best. Coming off the bench to wrap up games. Oh, he's hit the post. Oh, I set it up nicely for you. Dude, I've done everything and hits the post. That's nice and easy in Bolo, I will take that. And that is the end of the game, 1-0. We are still undefeated in the Champions League. That's two wins and one draw. So this is a dream start to this group that we're in. All right, so to end the episode, we're going to look at the two tables. We top our Champions League group. I just do not believe this, you know. We've won PSG at their ground 2-0. We came from behind to get a draw against Atletico Madrid. And we won Panifinaika. And here's the Barclays Premier League table. We are currently 11th in the table. Manchester City, Man United, Arsenal, Middlesbrough and Liverpool make up the top five in the relegation zone. You've got Norwich, Watford and Cardiff City. But that is going to be the end of the episode, guys. So if you did enjoy it, I'd appreciate it if you dropped a like, comment and subscribe if you're new. Until my next episode, have a great day.